we live in an interesting time. Um, and whether it's, it's a, a leap in the evolution of consciousness or whether it's because of the industrial age and, and the quickening that has come about in, in, in how we function as human beings. Whether it's unusual or whether it's part of the pattern, I'm not sure. You'll have to ask Darwin, did he, did he get it right day one? However, what's happening right now is that there's a, there's a mutation happening because we're not changing fast enough for the changing mechanisms that we have created in the world. And so the, the shift in consciousness that's happening now, it's, 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 it's phenomenally more rapid than how it used to be. Things are not as concrete and as solid, not as difficult to shift in folks' perception as it used to be. That's for sure, for sure. <clears throat> there seems to be... Um, uh, the mechanism of which truth is seen also, there seems to be less of um, a, a, a trauma or a dramatic shift. S spiritual shifts used to be really difficult on the body, really difficult on every level. They're not now. And what is that? How come? It's like our whole cellular, our, our cellular structures are more susceptible to transformation, to the embodiment of a higher frequency, a higher vibration. And, you know, while we have more toxicity, we also have more availability of hearing what's beyond all of it, of information, of new influences, of education. You know, we're learning how to use the mind at last. And so this is bringing about a quickening in the evolution of consciousness, that's for sure. <clears throat>